Hi there, explorers. Welcome aboard the SF, a science adventure. Today we're learning about experiments. Have you ever wondered how scientists figure out answers to big questions? Well, they use experiments to test their ideas and solve problems. And guess what? You can too. Let's dive into what makes an experiment so cool. First, every experiment starts with a question. It could be something like, what type of soil helps plants grow the fastest? This question is the problem we're trying to solve or the mystery we're exploring. Next, we make a hypothesis, an educated guess about what we think will happen. For example, I might guess, plants will grow the fastest in sandy soil. A hypothesis is like a prediction, and experiments help us find out if it's true. Then we need a procedure, which is just a fancy word for a step-by-step -step plan. It's like a recipe for your experiment. If we're testing soil, our procedure might include planting seeds in different soils, giving them the same amount of water and sunlight, and measuring how tall they grow. Now, let's talk about variables. In an experiment, there are three kinds. The independent variable is what you change, like the type of soil. The dependent variable is what you measure, like how tall the plants grow. And controlled variables are everything you keep the same, like the amount of water and sunlight. Keeping things fair is super important. During your experiment, you make observations by carefully watching and recording what happens. Maybe one plant grows super tall while another doesn't grow at all. That's your data, and it's like the treasure you're collecting. Finally, it's time for a conclusion. This is where you look at all your observations and decide if your hypothesis was correct. Did the sandy soil help the plants grow fastest? Maybe yes, maybe no, and that's okay. Even if your hypothesis wasn't right, you've still learned something important. So why do we experiment? It helps us answer questions, solve problems, and learn new things. Scientists use experiments to make discoveries, and so can you. Remember, experiments aren't about being perfect. They're about learning. To help you on your own science adventure, we've got an adventure guide video you can watch anytime. It has all the information you need to navigate today's escape room challenges. So grab your curiosity and get ready to explore. Let's see if you can use your new skills to complete the journey. Good luck, scientists!